So this is some future stuff. Um, uh, just like uh, pretty much the climate change edition, I guess we're going on tonight. But pretty much, you know, what's happening here? We have, uh, you, you see know, the, the climate's changed for me. I'm in a t-shirt instead of a hoodie. So. Yeah, it got pretty. It was like it, my car said it was like 72 degrees today in uh, Long Island. It was like I had my t-shirt on outside. That means I need to get that bottle of water out of my car. Oh, it's going to be half plastic now. Yeah, I'm going to just drink the cancer straight down. <laughs> Let me have an episode body. about that. We told you not to do that, Dr. Virginia. Stay away hey, from but the but it was Alex. fucking cold outside. <laughs> so I just left the bottle in there. I'm like, you know? No. So um, so pretty much what's happening here is um, the oceans are boiling up and all the animals are going to die. That's what's happening. And um, we have scientific proof of it. Um, But the proof of it now is happening. That means faster. I can get in the water? It's warm enough for me to get in it? Yeah, it's definitely nice for you now. It's going to be like a jacuzzi okay. in a few hundred years. So the... Um, oh, I, I'll, I'll definitely be food for other organisms. <laughs> So Hopefully not. Hopefully I'll still be here seeing like what kind of weird shit's happening in the world. Maybe okay. I get uploaded to a computer into or the internet. Yeah, that's what so pretty much what's happening here. Um uh summertime increases the upper ocean stratification. So pretty much the um the you know the water is getting a little hotter and it's kind of pretty much almost a fifth of the animals of sea life is gonna die by by um which is scary uh, by the year 2050, which is like... I mean, overfishing has already depleted a whole bunch of sea life. So imagine you add the uh, rising ocean temperatures to that mix. Yeah, so um, so this is what's happening. Um, so please appreciate the summer this year. If you can, social distance and go out on the beach because um, everything's dying. And I want to also show... I mean, That's there'll be a whole lot more summer, though. We might get, like, seven months of summer. Oh, yeah. I think summer's starting now today. Um, I hope so. See, I'm I'm one of these assholes that hates being cold. So if you're talking about, like, a lot of people are like, oh, my God, global warming. And I'm like, mm, I <laughs> like it hot. But then global warming <laughs> can mean, like, you know, fucking massive blizzards, which happened. New York, New York got some crazy snow this year so that's what also mean a subarctic you know tundra yeah but snow. that was after like three or four years of getting almost no snow yeah where we thought so, it was gonna be like a tropical rainforest in the, in the winter time pretty much oh, and know. then you get like mosquitoes seven times the size i mean it's, it's life is about trade-offs <laughs> so i want to show like this like you know people are innovating you know when in the, in the future when you can't go in the ocean because the acid is burning through your boat um you can ski on land so i want to show like you know this is what people are being innovative with a ski so basically what you're saying is all of the water is going to boil out of the ocean so there won't be any use for skis so you use them on flight land is that, yeah. is that what you're saying oh oh this is this is how the ocean is going to be this is going to be just the beds. This is the future of the ocean right here. Did we put tires on the bottom of it? <laughs> this seems to be like a craze of turning jet skis into motorcycles. I've seen this is another video of it. I'm gonna share another one. This seems to be a whole thing of jet cycles. Jet cycles. Now, that and sounds way cool. That sounds way cooler than what it looks like though. Jet cycle. I thought that looked pretty fucking cool. I don't know about you. Oh, uh, let's see this one again. Let's see this one. It's a whole bunch. Of this another one. <laughs> he looks goofy though. That that looks goofy. Oh, because of this one. Maybe because I made my judgment over this guy. I'm 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 sorry. Some of those biker gang guys just have to beat him up. <laughs> just, just beat him up. Just. Why are you looking? Why are you looking at him like that? Yo, yo. You're about to kick him rip, in his chest. Rip, rip that bottom rocker off his vest and beat the shit out of him. <laughs> yeah, so that's one. That's one. It's a whole craze. Is an. Um, show you another one. Yeah, this is this is the future right here. Get your get your jet ski motorcycle. I'm telling you. 
even call it a fish out of water. One California man says he gets plenty of confused looks when he drives his custom scooter around town because it looks like it belongs in the ocean. Marie Edinger has the story. It belongs to the streets. <laughs> says his buddy made something similar to Scootski first. See, look at he that. He built his, and now it's just like, that's freaking sweet. Look at his sunglasses. Yeah, I had to have one. And well, he's now that macho Stemple man has his own Scootski, he says he's never oh, going back. yeah! I love this thing. I've gotten rid of my other motorcycles, and I will, I ride this every single day. So, what is it? Stemple says he got a Honda Elite scooter off Craigslist, his friend had the jet ski, and after about two months of work, he had Scootski. The first question I always get is, does that thing float on water? And I always say, no, there's a huge hole at the bottom of it. Scootski goes up to about <laughs> 70 miles an hour. 70, damn. 30 or 40 miles to the gallon. And Stemple says he rides the thing anywhere and everywhere, wow. even the highway. It's just like putting a body kit on your car. The California Department of Motor Vehicles says you can't take any vehicle with less than 150 <laughs> cc motor size. You're driving an illegal highway. vehicle on the, the road. But the Honda Elite engine that powers Scootski is 250 cc's, so Stemple is good to go. Oh, One thing shit. I love about it is honestly just like how people are with you. You get like people, you know, probably just having like the worst day ever, and then they just see a jet ski going down the road, and they just have the biggest smile ever. Or like they're like fucking hallucinating. Now it is. Yeah, like I need to change the, the best day ever because they know that you're a vagina repellent. <laughs> I mean, huh. so that's the future of the ocean. People making jet scoot scoot skis. He doesn't have yeah, a jet. You got cycle. me there. I didn't know where the have fuck a you were going cycle. with that. Yeah, yeah you got me. Yeah, huh? Yeah, this is I, I didn't know where the fuck you were going with that. Yeah. So um, so so good on you. You you got me. You got me yeah. this time. So this is the future of, of um, the ocean is um, jet cycles. So um, that's some yeah. future. Yeah. Yep. That's uh, that. Cl I mean, robot dogs types dystopian. Yeah, it kind of fits in there. The robot dogs and jet cycles with like dudes making people smile with a jet ski. So like, that's Black Power Magic Hour on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube on Act TV, and then Dr. Regines is on YouTube, Facebook, and on uh, Discord. And that's some future stuff. Hey, guy, I just wanted to let you know, they're not smiling with you. They're smiling at you. <laughs>